Say you are an iOS developer and wanted to localize your app into Spanish. In order to do so, you first need to create a list of all the words and phrases used in your app. Then, ask a translator to translate the list of words and phrases into Spanish. Once translation is done, copy and paste the translation file to your Xcode project. Embed the translation file to your app and compile it. Then, submit your app to Apple and wait for about a week. Finally, your app is localized into Spanish. If you find translation mistakes, you need to fix the mistakes and compile your app again. Resubmit your app to Apple. After a week of waiting, you will see the new translation on your app. To make this long process much easier, use in-app translation. Add in-app translation SDK to your app. Adding and editing translation is really easy. Just use Dashboard. Even if you find translation mistakes after submitting your app to Apple, you can use in-app translation to fix the mistakes. You don't have to resubmit your app to Apple just to fix translation mistakes. You do not need to resubmit your app or wait for another week. Use in-app translation to make the localization process much easier and faster.